Okay, right. Uh, teardown part two officially starts here for me. This is the first proper teardown map um, that I've seen, well, mission um, that I've seen in part two yet. So uh, by that, I mean traditional heist sense. So look, we've got loads of targets here. We've got um, five, we've got eight total targets, two secondary ones. Um, I don't know how they're picking these secondary targets, if I'm honest with you, in this, in this one, because it doesn't really make it any harder. Um, necessarily but uh right okay so we're going to start in the top right corner here i'm not even sure what this is called the boon restaurant um i'm sure it says boom on the window um i'm going to start from here we're going to go over to where i've got my nice pink lambo parked smash into the building um do a few bits here and then we're going to go do a loop and we end up back over here uh okay right uh let me walk you through the customizations that are made to the map uh, it's not the tidiest one i got this on my first go um which doesn't necessarily mean that i'm a genius it just means that i'd smashed loads by the time i uh, i got it so anyway first target i'm going to pick up is going to be this shipping container or whatever here we're going to jump into the um into the jeep the jeep i got from you can see the tire tracks i got it from over there i, I, I don't know if it works better it's got a decent acceleration this i mean it's debatable whether you even need it but it's only going to be used for a few seconds just to give you some extra speed. I've put this wood in to ramp it. It's going to smash into the bush. As it does, you're going to jump out, smash E again, smash E to jump into our lovely pink Lambo. That is then going to be driven through here, which um, it's not what it originally looked like this, actually. I blew a th few things up. Um, this isn't the original door. I changed a bit of it. Um, with bombs and then I kind of took a little bit of the sh shrubbery out um, and changed a little bit of this shop. The leaf blower is really useful on this otherwise you're going to be picking up pieces. Uh, anyway you're going to smash the Lambo into here, you're going to go flying off into this, pick up the target. I took a hole out of the ceiling while I still had some shotgun shells left and planked it. Now the plank can just go straight over the escalator up here and um, just took out a little bit of walkway there. I moved that a bit out of the way. Now this is where it's a bit chaotic to see, but I took out the wall and the ceiling and the target, it, it won't dangle anymore. I, I, I mean, you could go up and drop down, but like, look, at the end of the day, it doesn't really matter, does it? It might be a bit quicker to go up, grab it and drop, but I don't know. So the target's there to grab. As soon as we do that, we turn right back round and I did have to take a couple of walls out here it's a bit more open plan than it originally was um yeah so you blew them up with bombs and you're going to go straight down well i just knocked a small hole in here and pulled this one through from the other side um at this point we've gone down here gone up gone up again and then we drop right back down to the ground floor Going up this plank again, just customised a couple of rooms, um, left the sofa in place to go up through this one, and then I've just moved this one across on the side here. So now we're above the doorway. That then takes us straight up again with some planks, a little bit of open plan living, um, took out the banister here. Initially I went round to the side and then look you can do this with shotgun shells but I had to do it with a rocket launcher because I'd waste them all so you, it looks a little bit more chaotic but basically you come straight up and we go through this side door here and we got ourselves a parcel. Grab the parcel and uh, yeah I took a few walls out again. Um, there's, there was a lot of infrastructure here it just literally blasted through the whole lot. And then you can just run straight off and drop all the way down. And then I've just pulled this target around a little bit more. I mean, look, you can see where I've just blown walls up all over the place. Um, I banged a bit of these over with the leaf blower to make it a bit easier. And then we've got our target there. Took out a wall. Originally, it didn't look like this. Um, and then the path goes straight over here to the escape vehicle. And then we'll be on our way. I mean, you, this didn't look like this. I mean, just did this for fun. I thought this would be, thought this would be part of the part of the process. Um, I mean, you can see where where I found my way in. So anyway, some extra bits and bobs that weren't needed to be done, but um, that's the general structure. Um, okay. So oh yeah, the Lambo, the Lambo. In case you are struggling to find it, which I don't think you would be, is right there. And as I say, air blow some of these things out of the way. It, it's not a bad drive. It's nothing like um, a 
on the Villa Gordon one. That was a pain in the ass. Okay, and then we're going to go up to the Jeep, and then we'll start here. And obviously, I'd recommend sticking a quick save on. Right, okay. Um, so, we're going to pick up the target. My driving skills went a bit crazy there. We're going to drive straight over here. That didn't go as well as planned. And this, you're going to have to turn a bit earlier to straighten it up. Whoa! Scopping me the first time. Fool. Straight onto the plank. Could make that wider at the bottom. Not had that problem before, though. Um, dropping down. Don't forget to actually grab them, as I sometimes forget to do. I don't know why I do that. Straight up through here. Feel a neat hole. Drop all the way down. Grab that one. And then we're nice and easy. All the way back. And don't forget to follow the loop. And um, 10 seconds to spare. Easy days. And that's your one. Um, mission time that took me 41 minutes, 19 seconds, including the fooling around that I did and uh, chatting to you lot. So straight in through the front door. Did have to take a bit of clearing out that. And then obviously we go up the planks. <laughs> That's where I uh, missed the plank. Not a very useful camera because you can't see through the roof. We go up along the top and we drop down. But anyway, uh, you get the idea. You can uh, always jump back if you need to see any of the other bits. But that is the first heist mission and I am 100% hyped to be playing Teardown again. This game is amazing. Hope that helps.